And we're cutting across to breaking news that's coming in of the uproar that's playing out in the Rajya Sabha. The opposition has staged a walkout from the upper house. The opposition wanted a detailed discussion today on the protesting farmers. The chairman, Venkai Naidu, said the discussion can happen only tomorrow. He said that today the Lok Sabha is discussing the president's address. Tomorrow there'll be a discussion in the Rajya Sabha on it, as is the norm. And the Venkai Naidu also mentioned that the president had brought up the farm laws and the farmers' protest, and hence a discussion on that can happen tomorrow. The opposition has wanted that discussion to happen today, not happening, and hence they staged a walkout. So drama already playing out in the Rajya Sabha. Moshmi Singh has joined us with more details on the this Moshmi, as expected, the opposition making it very clear that they will not allow business to continue till there is a discussion on the farmers' agitation and the farm loss. Absolutely, Akshata and Abhishek Manu Singhvi, senior member of the Congress Party, Raj Sabha MP is joining us. Let's take this to him, sir. Opposition staging a walkout. You've already given adjournment notices wanting a discussion. What are you intending? I am surprised why people are surprised. In fact, I'm astonished at this conduct of the government. Just consider, madam, in June we had a so-called session on these bills. That was guillotined. You know what happened. There was not one millimeter of discussion. After June, this is the first time in 18, uh, eight months that with thousands massed at Delhi's borders in such biting cold and with such adversity, first opportunity to discuss issues in the temple of democracy arises. And you can't prioritize it. But Mr. I think it's a non-issue. Venkaiya Naidu is saying that you've passed the law in the parliament, the president has given consent, and even the president has welcomed these three laws. That's not the law issue. I'm sorry, with great respect, I don't know what the uh, honorable chairman has said. I'm not uh, talking about him. I have to. I am saying simply what I am. The, the parliamentarians inside parliament and I are raising a totally different issue about the agricultural distress exhibited by these farmers. How can you avoid a discussion in parliament meeting eight months after this and 80 days after they are sitting there? Why can you avoid a discussion? You can you can say what you like, but at least have a discussion. But how does a walkout help? Because you don't get you don't get tell to me, speak. Tell, you, tell they me. don't hear you. The country doesn't hear no, you. No, there is anyway no hearing. Anyway, the discussion is not being taken up. What is the other way of making our point? And this is not the Congress. I don't know any party apart from the BJP and one or two parties of the few left in the so-called NDA. Nobody is objecting to it. Even the so-called supporters, issue-wise of the NDA, are supporting this. And all that, you are not understanding one basic thing. Is it not zid, arrogance, to say that we will not allow discussion? See, procedure is the handmaiden of justice. There is no procedural rule in the Rajya Sabha that I know of which prohibits a discussion because the law has been passed. Don't you discuss things after law has been passed? The same thing applies to you all. Couldn't you follow procedures as far as discussion is concerned? Because how? The, how? the list of businesses already come today. No, but the point is, if the list of businesses is majoritarian, then you cannot follow it. We have been asking about this for weeks before the parliament met. Right. Then we asked for it in the BAC. Then we asked for it yesterday and the whole country knows. I mean, suppose you do this discussion two weeks later. Will you have all the debts, the miserly, misery, the, the tribulation, the nails, the electricity cutoffs. In two weeks, you'll do all that and then you'll have a discussion so in parliament. the end of the road for you. You, you want a discussion anyhow. The whole country is concerned and the least parliament could do, and I don't think we are doing much at all, is to discuss this plight. That's so the meaning of democracy. Incidentally, people have seemed to have forgotten that. That, there you are, Akshita Abhishek Manu Singh, we are saying that the least that the parliament could do is discuss and because the opposition has got no way left, that's why uh, the politics of protest is the only way that they can uh, see as far as demanding a discussion is concerned. And as the opposition has staged a walkout, Rajya Sabha has been adjourned till 10.30 and we'll see what happens post that. But the government making it very clear today there will be no discussion in the upper house on the farmers' agitation. Chairman Venkatesh. And I do also highlighting that there's time for it tomorrow, but not today. Moshmi, thank you for those details and for getting us that exclusive conversation with Mr. Singhvi. We're slipping into a very short break here on India Today. We'll be right back with lots more news and updates of what's happening in Parliament. Stay with us.